Hey YouTube, welcome back to a brand new Animal Crossing New Horizons video. Today we are taking a look at a brand new fan made tool that helps you predict how much your turnips will sell for in New Horizons. It's really cool so without further ado, let's get straight into today's video. So as you know, Daisy May arrives on our islands every Sunday morning and offers to sell us pretty much as many turnips as we want to buy at a random price. We then have the rest of the week to sell these turnips before they go rotten. Each day between Monday and the following Saturday, Timmy and Tommy will give us a set price for what they are willing to pay for our turnips, which changes every 12 hours. They give their first price during the AM and a second price in the PM, so basically we get two chances per day to turn a profit, because let's face it, no one wants to sell their turnips for less than they paid. Now turnips can be bought for as low as like 20 or 30 bells each and sold somewhere in the range of 600 plus bells so every day New Horizons players can potentially make millions of bells literally. This is known as the stalk market. Now this stalk market may appear pretty random and it is but the algorithm Timmy and Tommy use to calculate what prices they offer to buy our turnips does follow certain predefined patterns and can be somewhat predicted based on how much our turnips were bought for on the Sunday and what offers we receive throughout the week. Using this data we can get a good idea of what prices we can expect thanks to a tool called Turnip Calculator. All we have to do is record our turnip prices twice a day and we can see a range of prices that our offers will fall into. So let's check it out. So this is the Animal Crossing New Horizons Turnip Calculator. As you can see it starts as a blank canvas allowing us to input the price we bought our turnips for followed by the prices Timmy and Tommy give us each day. As you can see the graph is showing default values and averages and stuff like that so let's put in the price Daisy May sold us turnips for which this week was 102 bells. Not the best price but definitely not the worst. So you may have just noticed the graph has already changed and started to predict where our turnip prices will fall over the next few days based solely on how much we bought them for. And if we check predictions for tomorrow, which is Monday AM, we can see the buy price, which we already know is 102. And just below the guaranteed minimum offer we will receive will be 85 bells. This is the absolute lowest offer we will receive from Timmy and Tommy. We also get the average, which is 100. So that's not far off the 102 price. So I'd say it's looking pretty good. The maximum turnip price Timmy and Tommy will offer tomorrow is 145 which is good because that's way more than 102 however the minimum price they will offer is only 39 bells which is terrible and a third of the price we paid. So we know Monday in the AM our price will fall between 39 bells and 145 with an average of 100 so at this point it could go either way. Anyway, moving on, Monday's AM price turned out to be 91 bells, so below average, but just as the graph predicted as it was in between 39 and 145, so it's pretty accurate. And of course, based on this, it now suggests Monday PMs will be between 34 and 145. Of course, we don't want to sell at a loss, so we know at this point to keep our bells, plus looking at the graph, there's a good indication that the max will be pretty high at some point during the week. Monday's PM price was 127, so a reasonable improvement on 102, it would of course make a profit, so let's add that to the calculator. And immediately we can see quite a drastic change in the graph and already is giving a pretty clear indication that a potential maximum will be in the range of 600 on Tuesday PM, but don't forget that's just a prediction and there's also a possibility of a minimum as low as 60, ouch. So based on Monday's input so far, it's predicting Tuesdays will have a maximum of 206, but a minimum of 60 with an average of 107. So we know Tuesday is looking very good. And if we wanted to sell turnips quickly, could be the day to do it. Anyway, Tuesday AMs turned out to be 169, which is much higher than our base price of 102. So would give us a pretty decent profit. And again, the graph correctly predicted it as 169 is between 60 and 206. It could have been a bit higher, of course, but it's well above average, so it's pretty decent. Let's put 169 in and see the effects on future prices. 
And just like that, you can see it fully reinforces Tuesday PM is looking really, really good with a maximum of 614, which is probably the highest I've ever seen in any Animal Crossing game, to be honest, but a minimum of 141, which for a minimum is still pretty high actually. So even if I was unlucky and got the minimum price next, we know we'd still turn a profit. You may also notice the average has increased right now to a massive 290, so it's looking really good, but we have to take note of the rest of the week, and we can see after Tuesday PM, everything starts to drop off. So it turns out that Tuesday PM was a whopping 596 bells per turnip, which as the graph indicated is on the higher end of the scale towards the maximum of 614, and will net us more than five times as much as we originally paid. Let's input this in the graph. As you can see, it adjusts the graph accordingly. It seems this week we are super lucky and got peak prices on Tuesday. Now the graph suggests Wednesday will also be a pretty good day, offering a profit if we miss the massive price increase Timmy and Tommy offered on Tuesday PM, with a minimum of 141 and a maximum of 206. So again, based on the data so far, we turn a profit on the Wednesday, and it even looks like the minimum guaranteed price would be 202 bells, which is nearly double, so nothing to complain about. But after Wednesday AM, all the prices drop significantly. And although are subject to change based on future prices, the minimum, the average, and even the maximum Timmy and Tommy will offer look to be below the 102 base price that we purchased the tournaments for originally for the rest of the week. So really, no matter what the price is the next day, we need to sell now or we'd likely lose bells. So yeah, this gives you a good idea of how to use the turnip calculator and shows us that by inputting our prices, we can get a good idea of when to keep our turnips or when to sell them. Before the peak on Tuesday PM, we saw good profits from Timmy and Tommy on the Monday PM and the Tuesday AM that were pretty much above average and more towards the maximum predictions. And without the graph, we may have sold our turnips at that price only to find out we could have made even more if we'd have waited until the Tuesday afternoon. So this tool is really awesome. I'd like to thank the creators and the developers of this tool. This is one of the many reasons I love this community. People are always wanting to help each other out. It's awesome. Anyway, I hope this will help some of you. I definitely recommend you check it out and give it a try. Just remember there's still an element of randomness and some weeks will be better than others. Some players will receive higher and lower peak prices because the algorithm does follow certain patterns, but hopefully this tool will help you sell before you lose any bells. Anyway, for now, they're pretty much wraps up this video. If you're an Animal Crossing fan, don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on any New Horizons news. Until then, I'd like to give a special thank you to this channel's Patreon supporters, you guys rock. Don't forget to head over to our Discord server too. And of course, if you got this far in the video, please comment turnip. Just let me know you did, that would be super awesome. And please be sure to include what turnip prices you have had recently and whether or not you've been using this calculator. I'd love to know. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and found it entertaining. Please be sure to leave a like if you did. Thanks for watching. I hope you have an amazing day. Stay safe and I'll see you in my next video. Peace.